Hello everybody, this is Fight Club Hubs. Welcome to another wonderful episode of Game Jam. We are continuing Original versus Remake Month, and uh, for the third episode this month, I have I am joined by my brother John, and we are going to be playing both the original EGA version of Space Quest One, the Sarian the Sarian Encounter, which was released in 1986, and he is going to be playing the uh, point and click graphical upgrade known as the VGA version uh, that was released in 1991. Pretty much, it's the at the time uh, of the 1990s. Uh, Almost every single type of uh, point and, or every type of graphical adventure game that was out transitioned from being a typing adventure game. Now, if you remember games, classic games like Zork back in the early A's, where it was just like a screen, like what you see right here, followed by word prompt, where you type in actions asking to look around the room and whatnot, and then they improved to into graphical adventure games, which is where you got stuff like. Leisure Suit Larry, and Space Quest, Police Quest games, and the whole armada of Sierra games, not to mention other games from other companies like LucasArts, and um, pretty much anybody who, you know, threw their hand in the basket at the time. Uh, but about the late 80s, early 90s is when everyone went from the typing interface to a point-and-click interface, which is very convenient to say the least, because it was really hard to type some of the things, because it was very were keyword specific in regards to what you could do uh john how much do you remember of the uh, vga remake um i'm actually really shocked that i remember the opening and i remember this part right here besides that i yeah it's been a long time yep so been a long, long time i apologize uh everyone because 1986, sound cards weren't invented yet, <laughs> and you had to listen to boops and beeps uh, processed by the computer itself. Let me fix my camera here. I'd never noticed that. I look like a freaking lobster. Hmm. One day. Uh, I have to read... <sighs> yes, John. You unfortunately Great. have to read. No, there's my can. There we go. Out input. Do, do, do. There we go. Now I don't look like a lobster anymore. Now I do. Well, at least I can be seen. All right. So we are gonna go GVN as my name. Now I have a typing version of the game. John has the classic point-and-click adventure with all the improved music, some audio, uh, like, all that stuff. Doo, doo, doo. So, you are startled by the sound of an alarm. It is followed by an urgent voice which warns that the Arcadia has been boarded by an unknown intruders. It ends abruptly. Okay, I'm gonna... Ooh, that's right, WASD does not do crap in this day and age. Oh, there, there is. Oh, crap. We're going to start moving. <laughs> yeah, I don't have that. Now, that's the first big di issue right there. There is no... Uh, I, had, I don't have anything that tells me whether or not... Uh, 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 there's no countdown or warning or anything of, uh, of that nature coming out. Uh, like a countdown or anything. I'm just told, oh, hey, there's something happening. Oh, crap. Oh, the men. Oh, okay, there we go. Professor King. You know what? I need to increase the speed. There we go. Now he's going to a nice dead. sprint. Normally you would be able to tell, except that this... Look at man. Hanging out of the no. right. A large be. laser hole has been burned in his uniform, through which you can see previously unexposed tissue. Struggling painfully, he raises up and raises up, raises up on one elbow. He tells you the Arcadia is under attack, and that the star generator is in danger. You had better leave if you value your life. He looks toward the shelves full of cartridges and utters the words, Astral Body. He then settles to the floor lifeless. Oh, that reminds me, John. I need to give you one more. I need to give you a link. What's that? Because you, you, you don't have the manual, so you're going to need passcodes. So pause the game by moving your mouse to the top. Okay. All right, so let me get you a link. Uh... I've been good to know. There you go. Uh, old DRM. Bloop. 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 
Yep, good old fashioned DR. Well, this actually came with the game itself, but yeah, you guess you can call it a form of DRM. Oh, they, they all were. All, all, all the old instruction manuals had like things, and like the old DRM was like, oh, what what is the first word on the fifth page of the um? Mm -hmm. uh, you're gonna love this when I got when the, 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 those games I showed you, John. When I said complete, it came with all the DRM like manuals and stuff like that and passcodes. So the the one specifically for Maniac Mansion has this red little visor that looks like, you know, the old 3D glasses of back in the day, the little cardboard red and blue one. Yeah. And you had to scan it up and down the piece of paper to find the specific keyword or whatever. Uh, <laughs> yeah. That's 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 harsh. That's pretty specific, don't you think? A little bit. So why is Skype says I'm offline, by the way, so I don't know what's up with that. Not We're still very I'm... online. Yeah. Okay, so I have to look for astral bodies. You have to walk Get around. Off the and ship. Well, you got to walk around and do stuff, yeah. Well, go to your left. I'm just going to give you one little hint. Go to my left? Uh, I want to talk to the, the, the floating robot. You can't obtain that here. Son of a bitch. Say what? I said type astral bodies. Okay, okay. <laughs> Console consists of a screen, keyboard, and cartridge slot. Atop it rests a module DX cartridge retrieval unit. How would you like to use that? Well, it gives you uh, a relationship status. A lot of scientists really know exactly what it's monitoring. Who knows what that is? And the conduit just runs through to carry some ventilation. Wow, what is? I know I have to get the key, the the, the key card. I th I think I'm gonna die, die with the ship. You're gonna go down with the ship. I think so. No, you're not. Don't don't be negative like that. There's plenty of time. Remember to save often. And run away if you hear footsteps. Oh, those are all my save files. <laughs> That's awesome. Um, well, a couple of them are Joe's, and uh, one of them is Julie's. <sighs> I'm going to say the footsteps are, are coming from upstairs. So what am I supposed to be doing? Just just getting off the uh, ship? Grab what you can before you leave. Mm. Oh, more people are dead. Something flashing there must be important. Oh, my goodness. There we go. Look at the screen. <laughs> We're off to a good start. I wasted five minutes just trying to get a cartridge. 
Yes, I hear footsteps, I know. Uh, I'm already down five minutes. Oh, not, that's not a place to go. Jerry didn't have anything on him. Keep hearing footsteps, but nothing's happening. You don't look above you, do you? Well, I mean, now, yeah, but like... Is there something important in this room? Uh, sure. Look for anything that stands out. Nothing standing out. You don't see? You, oh, you're in the wrong room. Did you go to the generator room? I did. I grabbed the little blinking light thing. Okay. Did you search the crewmates? Like corpses anywhere or anything like that? I've searched, I think, every crewmate. Oh, then you're good to go. Uh, I haven't found anything off of anyone. Yes, I know. Footsteps. I think I checked both of these people. Is there stuff off of people I'm supposed to be grabbing? I don't have a directory called Save Game. What? Mm -hmm. uh, do I have to create a save folder or something? Where is my Steam library, real quick? Uh, Let's try this. Save. <sighs> what do you mean there is no directory? Get the hell out of here! Great, so I better uh, play it safe the whole time. You can't save? It's not letting me. Um, what am I supposed to do here? Clearly doesn't go there. Doesn't go there either. Um,
How do I back out of this? Um. Uh, there should be somewhere around the edge. Uh, like move slowly, or go go up, scroll up, scroll up. Okay. Uh, there's an exit button. There should be an exit button on the pad. Okay, is there anything, like, what am I supposed to do here? I don't understand. It's not working for me. Everything's dying. I'm going to die. Okay, I, I, um, is this everything I'm supposed to have? Was I supposed to find more things? Uh, did you get the key card? Did you get the key card, the, uh, key card yet? I did. Not that, did you get the cartridge? Is this not the cartridge? No. What did the old oh. man say to you when he was dying? What old man? Huh? Leave and try leave. Try and leave the room again. Uh, there wasn't. A, was there supposed to be an old man in here? There you go. Just pay attention to what he says. Mhm. Hold on a second. Okay, um, black holes. What do you say? Something about black holes. Okay. Use the thing. I'm just. That's is your only tips I'm giving you. Black holes. Um, Look at the website I gave you. I'm looking at it. Oh, I don't miss this. I totally miss this. Oh, I got a uh, friendly charm. Now I think you can get the hell out of there. If I knew where getting the hell out of there is. Didn't do anything. Um, oh, no, no, I died. Is this even the same game? Like, yours looks completely different than mine. Yeah, unless I, you're like ahead of mine, uh, ahead of me. I was ahead of you, but get get in there. Now I gotta start over. 
You are dead. You can only restore, restart. Okay, I guess I have to create a directory. Is this the right room? Uh, yeah. You're go Just keep moving. Well, you only have a minute left, so you better hustle, boy. Uh, I have no idea what I'm supposed to be doing. Keep going across. The go over the screen. Yeah. There you go. Okay. All right. Now let me see if this will work. Oh, you know what? What happened? Oh, I gotta go into the uh, DOS box configuration for my game real quick. They probably didn't even bother to make a path for saved games or mount or mounted a path for saved games and whatnot. So where? Let me just do this real quick. Well, I'm gonna die. Yeah, well, <laughs> that's life. Wait, what is this Space Quest VGA I'm looking at? Why do they have a listing for Space Quest VGA? That makes no sense. Okay. I want to see here. If this is the bulk of the image, the units occurs for her and I'll just the. Uh... This universe. Right. I think I, I, I don't have enough time left. No, well, maybe I do. You might want to go back a second. Why? Look at the... I don't know, is that a window there? That right there? That doesn't look like a window, does it? Um... You know what? Hold up. Why, why am I looking at the window? Not that window. Go back. Left or right? Right. There it is. Ugh. Horribly <clears throat> optimized. Holy shit. Oh, there we go. Oh, well. Hold up. Figured it out? Yep, yeah, thank you. I should have time.
It really gives me like no time to do anything. I mean, yeah, old games um, let you save fail pretty bad. Yeah. Might as well just restart. Yeah, why not? It's randomized. I know. Just trying to trigger it. You trigger it by going in and out of the room a couple times. I've done that. There we go. See? Trigger it by sitting down. Magnetic fields. All right, so that is that symbol with the, that symbol with that symbol again with that symbol again. Oh, crap. Dang it. I didn't grab it. You silly boy. Congratulations, you have narrowly escaped an explosive death. Don't start patting yourself on the back just yet. Though you are now traveling aimlessly through the cosmos. Alright, uh... Push auto-nav. Corona. Nothing to do but hang on. Ah! Crash. At last. Maybe I should follow them. Are you sure you want to look at that? Yes! Oh my god, um... It's always nice when you know exactly what to do.
Oh, now which way do I go? I go this way, because now I know. <laughs> and knowing is half the battle. I hear footsteps. Down here? Yes, hide behind that thing or you're going to get shot. Oh, crap. It's the exploding spider thing. Ah, <laughs> he got me and I got to start over. Crap. You didn't save I didn't save. No. <laughs> oh, well. I need to figure out how to, how to fix this, actually. Ah, crap. Whatever. Reading. Reading's for losers. Yes, it is. Yes. Make up your own sound effects while you're at it. Pew! Pew, pew! Door opening. Walk, 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 walk. Mm-hmm. You know what? I'm going to close this out real quick, and I'm going to do something else. You're going to play a different game? No. <laughs> no. Uh, I, I chose my game, and I'm sticking with it. Brave danger. Stars. Stars. Oh, that's loud. Right. Wait, where am I going? Stars. I H U E. Double I. Weird H U then. Weird E. Mm -hmm. Grab that. Getting better. Oh my god. Both versions we're, we're, don't want to save. <laughs> that sucks. Just be really good at the game. <laughs> I mean you probably played this game a thousand times. Not the uh not not the VG not the EGA version. I I could probably speed run the V the, the remake. Are the footsteps randomized? Sometimes. Uh... Get ahead of the game here. It's weird how all these uh, point-and-click adventure games, when I played them when I was younger, everything just made more sense back then. Like, now it's like things just don't come, like, like easily. Like, oh, of course that's what we have to do. Yep. Did I not grab the key card? I, didn't s I have to search a lot of people's bodies, don't I? Uh, there's only a few you need to search. 
But I have to search the bodies, though. Yes. Crap. So far, I don't think I've heard any footsteps in this game at all. In fact, I don't think I've ever encountered siren, uh, sirens yet. Sirens yet. Store. You got. They went bang bang on you. Yeah. That's a really loud car. Yeah. Yeah. For some reason, sound travels really well with um, cars that drive by. The question is, is the key cards uh, randomized? No, they're not. If you like pina corona... It's not even close to the words. I know. But there's no songs about Corona. There we go. Thank you, Jerry. Jay. Jerry. Inventory. Some army and dehydrated water. Yeah. <laughs> I get it. <laughs> See, like it was like weird, like the first playthrough it was like I never heard the, the footsteps or I never encountered them. Now it's like every oh single room is like... Oh my god, is that all I had to do? Oh look, I even have saved games. What'd you have to do? I just had to leave it blank. See, look. Save file. I just had to leave it blank and hit enter. <laughs> oh my god. That makes it so much better. Now it's time to outrun the spider.
Or not. Oh yeah, that's where I gotta go. Oh crap, there's a spider. Good thing I grabbed that spacesuit. Um. No, I missed. Oh, safety first. Where the hell's the power? Uh, it's gonna do this to me. <laughs> it's making you read, boy. I'm gonna, gonna learn you good. Make me read, like, what does it make me read? Graphical adventure. Be happy you don't have to type stuff. Suddenly you see a large black metal sphere falling out of the sky. A Sarian spider droid. Upon touching down on the planet's surface, it sprout legs and begins its search for you. You recall from an article in Space Piston Magazine that this droid is designed to seek out organic life forms and self-destruct when contact is made. Yay, I'm leaving. Come on, come on, come on, come on, you're stupid, you're stupid, come on, why are you going back and forth like that, you're stupid! I'm not over there, dummy, I'm over here, Down here up here, dummy, over here, dummy, come on, come on! Come over to this very obvious trap I've got laid out for you. Come on. You're a retarded droid, you know that? Mm, let's go to the other screen and then come back, see if that does anything. Ooh. There he is. Ooh. What does this button do? I hope you're saved. <laughs> 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 Famous last words. I wonder what this button does. Oh. Oh, what? T Tacticolor. Oh. So, okay, let's look at it right here. Line it up against the plant. Enjoy your little trip into uh, Nottingham Forest. Yes! Yes! It was not known that you are a master of the rock. That was a fine effort. Mwahahaha. <laughs> You having fun reading <laughs> your, about your death? Seems like a weird feature to have. Future? <laughs> uh, feature to have in this ship. Oh uh, yeah, what? Space travel? No, time travel.
Oh, tattooing. Nice. Uh -huh. Let's see here. Tell a friend. Hmm. No. I don't have anything I think I can use here. Need to clog that somehow. Ah, there we go. Kind of obvious. Do, 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 do. I love the vibrant colors of brown and black here. You got a little, you got a little purple there, pink, lavender, whatever you want to call it. Oh, that looks friendly. Look at, hmm. Oh, hey, sandworm. I think you went the wrong way. Oh. Just, the, just, 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 um, just a guess. Is that all these pods do is crash? Yep. Thank you for buying Arcadia Airlines. I think it looks a little bit prettier than yours. Uh, I remember this. Oh, don't tell me I'm missing something. This all looks familiar. It looks familiar. I think we had a lot of fun running around looking at that. I don't remember what to do, but I just remember it. I think I forgot. I definitely forgot something. Uh, see if I can go back. No. Let's see, do I have. Old issue of Space Pistol Magazine that the droid was designed to seek out organic life forms since self destruct, which through 72 the target has been achieved. Great. Let's try this again. Yeah, why is it already on me? Why is it already there? It's gonna be doing that for a while. Don't worry, he's gonna be chasing me in a minute. Am I past you? I restarted because I missed an item. This thing is like all over the place. Is that little droid? I must. Oh, there he is. Took him a while. Huh. Okay. She saved.
Why can't F5 be a quick save button? Because <laughs> it's 1991 and people are stupid. Just like this stupid robot that's walking across the bottom of my screen like I'm gonna somehow like he's gonna somehow get to me. Come on down, my pretty. I have a friendly rock you wanna meet. <sighs> this is so random and annoying. Oh my god. I'm glad I can't speedrun this game. There we go, Jesus Christ. Hmm. Let's try walking this way. Did the robot get you? No. I mean, yes, yes, he did, which reminds me. I want to point out how incredibly annoying it is. That uh, Skype thing, that, uh, ex that uh, I'm appearing offline. It's whatever. Well, if I'm appearing offline, then no one can see me or watch me. Uh, on Skype or? Or not on Skype, but on, uh, on uh, Twitch. I can see you on Twitch. I know you can see me, but I can't see how many viewers I have or anything. <laughs> there, this is my version of the dumb rocks part. Yep. Except the robot will be stupid enough for you to to walk under it. Am I supposed to drop a rock on him, or am I supposed to fall on him? You're supposed to push the rock on him. Oh, that wasn't pleasant. I don't see a rock, though. That's the problem. It's not going to exactly be a rock, but go back. I would like to at least beat this game. I know I can beat the first one in about an hour. Very easily. Really? Within an hour? Yeah. I think when I tried beating it, when I tried, when I did my little marathon of playing all six games, I'm pretty sure I beat the first one in just over an hour. Oop. Got him. Huzzah! Hail the victorious John! He has conquered the explosive droid! That wasn't too bad. I'm walking over, this is gonna kill me. Yep, yeah, big ol' scream. Alright, uh. I gotta go back to here. I'm pretty sure there's something at the far end I'm supposed to grab. I 
Ah. Alien kicked me out because I couldn't listen to him because I couldn't turn on the gadget. Really? That's lame. Oh well. I know what he wants me to do. I gotta go kill the ore rod. Kill the ore rod. Kill the ore rod. Wasn't there supposed to be like I don't know, like Tie Fighters and something like a like a junkyard in here somewhere? Space Quest Three. Oh. How about that, John? One day you and I can just marathon all the Space Quest games. Yay. Why not? I guess that's not the cave. That's definitely not the cave. There it is. Ah, I wasn't fast enough. Creature of you, uh, a huge creature with mass mobility and speed. I was not ready. No. Oh. So I, I could have gone here and never dealt with a spider? There we go. Go boom. Ah, I killed him. He went boom. Like a classic Looney Tunes character. Ducky go down the hole. How do you feel about the Animaniacs being rebooted? I don't know. Have you seen any of the DuckTales uh, sneak peeks yet? No, I was going to ask you if it started yet. August 12th. I am actually excited. I wasn't sure. Me thinks I shouldn't go this way. <laughs> Me thinks you should. But how? Shall when, you go When did I grab the... Hmm. Do, 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 do. Okay, that should be the last time I have to go over that bridge because it looks like it's going to crumble and kill me. Hmm. Well, that was. I just got lucky there. What was that? I just threw some flowers on it and now it's. Um... <laughs> That's a good guess. Congrats. Me, I just. For me in this game, I have to literally slide against the wall. Oh, I got something pointing and there's a hole there. Oh, look at that. Save. <laughs> I want to see what kind of crazy stuff you're going to do. Hmm. Let's walk into the acid. Look at the acid. Oh, but the first sign of your mushroom the first seem to have no bottom. The gentle dripping has a soothing effect on the physical nerves. So I'm going to try to get you the head of it. Let's get my hand in there. Did it tell you not to touch yourself? There we go. <laughs> I'm melting! Oh, 
I don't know what the deal is with these two. They're the game cre there's the they're the game's creators, the two guys from Andromeda. Don't you know who they are? They're international rock stars. How dare you be uh rude? Two guys from Andromeda, please forgive him, for he know not what he hath said. It's the longest death scene ever. Without a means of look. You are obviously in need of transportation. It has come to my attention that you have met Orat. If you have proof of Orat's demise, drop it for my inspection. Mm. You drop the Orat part to the ground. The vision is silent. You are startled by a rumbling, and suddenly an oddly shaped door comes into view. It slowly opens. You hear a voice, different this time, beckoning you to step forward. It's almost like I played this game. <laughs> Please don't be alarmed. We intend no harm. We are a peaceful race. We are cautious, however. Others don't share our way of life. Welcome to Corona. You are standing in the power generation facility of our underground settlement. All power here is produced by steam. That is unimportant to you, however. We have promised you transportation. <laughs> I'm going to be driving in a Roomba. <laughs> <laughs> that thing looks like a giant Roomba. Oh my goodness. I'm trying to look. You can't oh, see. The th uh, look all the way to the right and that little black and white thing. Oh. <laughs> oh I just. Clearly, if I walk through this, I'm going to die. It's a pattern. <laughs> this is a skimmer. It hovers approximately half a meter above the traveling surface. This is very important because of Grell. Grell and his like dwell in caves below the sand. If you stand on the surface too long, your chance you chance becoming a rare moist meal for him. The skimmer is programmed to take you to a settlement on the other side of Corona called Ulensi Flats. You can further travel. Make you, you can you, blah, 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 blah. you can make further travel arrangements there. I am sorry. This is all we can offer. I hope your trip is a safe one. Board the skimmer, then you are ready to depart. Good luck, strange one. Oh, this is. I should have went right there. <sighs> uh, whoever shall read this, my name is Dr. Slash Vohal. I am a scientist with the Star Generator Project aboard the Star Lab Arcadia. We have just successfully completed the development and testing of the Star Generator. During this time, I have come to believe that our progress has been monitored by others. I fear that the Sarians may have learned of our mission. It is my If my fears prove true, the Star Generator and the people of our universe are in serious jeopardy. <laughs> The Star Generator is a miraculous device. Used as intended, it will preserve life for eons to come. Used as a device for evil, it will cause the destruction of millions of lives and enslave all who oppose the Saurians. Encoded within the cartridge are all plans and specifications for the construction of the Star Generator. Should any disaster befall the Star Generator project, scientists would be able to create a duplicate of the Star Generator with this information. Please guard this with your life. Return it to the Xenon ruling body as quickly as possible. Important note, the Star Generator was cap is capable of self-destruction. This was introduced to the system as a precaution. To activate it, one must enter 6865. A five-minute timer will begin to count down. Beware, anyone within five kilometers of the Star Generator will be, will be in danger once the timer has been initiated. Please car be careful and good luck. Take the cart. Let us save. Uh, skimmer. Skimmer! Alright. Okay, look. Yeah, as described, skimmers, blah, 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 blah. And a keyhole with a key in it. Okay, so turn key. 
You turn on the key. You can't help but wonder what you've gotten yourself into this time. You nervously hang on. Do I get to drive it? Oh, I almost got it. I zoom off. Wow, that's not fair. Alright, I'm going to have to slow the game down, sadly. Oh my gosh, I did it. Save. Oh, wait. Did you turn on your gadget? No. That hurt. I hit two of them. Don't throw like serious. That's not good. No. Woo. Stop killing me. Okay, that's not a good start. Really? I think these are randomly generated rocks now. Meant to piss me off. Oh, come on! Um, I will be right back. You have fun. Like, I can now count the frames at the slowest speed. Oh my god. I don't care if this takes me like 20 minutes to get to Ulensi Flats. That buzzing sound is so annoying. Just 
flying overhead with my little Roomba. Nothing I could have done about that one, jeez. Oh, come on! Piece of crap! are starting to ring just from listening to this obnoxious uh, humming of the damn skimmer. Oy vey. Really? How did that hit me? Oh my god. Wonky hit detection. Let's try this.
That hit me for real. Oh, that was random as hell. Yeah, these are randomly generated. That is freaking hilarious. Hey, welcome back. I only died a half dozen times on the skimmer. It's alright. I can't tell if anyone's watching besides you and me. No, uh, there's one other person. It just says two. Oh, I made it. Now there's a huge echo I'm hearing going on. Is there something with your, going on with your mic? No, that would, that would be weird because... I don't know. Well, I don't know. Maybe. I'm just hearing a giant echo. Um, I don't think so. I mean, I just unmuted the Not mic. Not an echo, but, uh... And I'm listening through everything through my uh, headphones. Oh, well. Okay, after a truly stone-crushing journey, you have miraculously arrived safely in Ulysses Flats. And just in time, too, because the skimmer's power cell has been drained. It will take some time to recharge itself. This place isn't quite what you had expected. It seems it is semi-bleak at best. Let's go back to normal speed. Hey, John? Yeah. Yes? Uh, your mic was just suddenly getting really loud. Is it better now? Uh, you might want to modify it so that the mic in Skype does not take exclusive control of it and tell it to not like do auto volume or anything like that when it gets quiet. Okay. Because that might affect it. So let me just unmute you now. There we go. How's it sound? Much better. Is this a good volume? Yeah. All right. I just uh, took it off auto. Uh, Why does it take so long to save these settings? I don't understand. There we go. Everything's good, though? Okay. My volume is still good? Yeah, your volume's fine. Okay. Okay, back to the game. Search debris. Search ash. What is that crap? Yeah, it's easy top. Okay. And a jetpack.
Hey, it's Gre it's Greedo. 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 The uh, green alien that shot Han. I have no idea where I'm supposed to get water from. Uh -huh. Alright, so I gotta win enough money, so let's see here. F4, F6, F3, F8. Sweet. Suck, Bethane. That's cute. Oh, no. Gotta come on, Papa needs a new pair of shoes. Cherry, yeah. How am I supposed to get water from? Happened. I keep dying from dehydration. You have a survival kit, didn't you? Uh, do I? I don't know. Did you grab one from your spaceship? No. Oh, jeez, I'm just losing so much money. Seriously, it's like the moment I get back to this, the, the spaceship, I, I, I die. I, I, I can't get to my spaceship right now. Uh... <sighs> oh, my gosh. What's... Do you have an earlier restore? No. I mean... Yes. Actually, now this is going to kill me. Pretty sure. Died. That ain't fair. Wow. Even my uh, earlier restore kills me like right away.
Oh look, I'm past you. Am I? No. Or yeah. Oh, you're using my save files? You cheap little bastard. Back to the exploding ship. <laughs> You're just going all over the place, aren't you, John? Well, I found a safe file that was back on the exploding ship. Well, so. That's good. So does it have everything you need? I think so. I don't know. Maybe you want to double check that inventory. I did. I think this is everything I need. I'm winning, winning money. Isn't this where you're supposed to use the magnet? There is no magnet in this one. Oh. It's funny how you remember that. It is. You don't remember anything else in the game, but you sure as hell remember that magnet. For some weird reason. And now I have this stupid pack. Ooh, I want a streak. Ah, figures! Thank you. 
I like how the uh, cause the uh, the thing mocks me. You're worthless. Suck at methane. Damn, this game is really not liking me. Yeah, you're picking up your mic's picking up a lot of volume again, John. Uh okay, hold on. Alright, where where is that Skype? No oh, dumb looking at it. Doop -a -doop. Better? Yeah. So exciting sitting here pl trying to manipulate a slots game. What's the matter? Just use the magnet. There is no magnet in the EGA version. I told you that. Oh, that sucks. Yes. Imagine how I felt. Or well, you remember Daniel Fostick, I'm sure. He, 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 yeah, he, I think he was surprised 
I think he and I both played the VGA version before the EGA version. We were wondering, like, why can't we win the slots game? I'm losing money now. I'm getting close to my the money I'm trying to win. Ever so slowly. I'm ever so slowly getting somewhere in this game. Hey, progress. Sometimes you gotta take your time. Oh, stupid game. You, why do you taunt me so? Ah, uh, back to the melting. it again? Yeah, I'm going to melt about five more times. Absolutely not in the mood for dumb timing things. <laughs> <laughs> You're in a rush. Ain't nobody got time for that. There seems to be a circuit malfunction. Yay! Please allow two decades for delivery. seem to be a very easy pattern with this. The uh, zigzag is what I usually do. Like, each section is its own, uh... Like, its own pattern to that thing. barely hit me.
do 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 Stupid bartender. Let's go buy myself a little robot. Let's go buy a fly boy. Oh, seriously? I, I could walk up and down? Wow. Wow, wow, wow. Don't grab the one that blows up. Hmm. I need to buy a ship first, I think. So I can see how much money I have. Left over. Let's see if you'll follow me up here. Yay, bought a ship. Now I gotta buy the robot. It's in my inventory. What do I do for the water? Yeah, take it out of your survival kit. And then you click it on yourself. Okay. Click it or tick it. Easy peasy. I don't have enough money. How do I not have enough money? Go drink a beer. The peacemaker. Nah, I don't think I need a peacemaker. Mm. How am I supposed to kill the dude? Which one? The old rat? Yeah. Uh, see if he wants a drink. 
I'm just saying. I don't know. I could be wrong. Oh. That was easy. Flip on the scanner. Section HH. So I heard I head toward it and you see, and right there in front of me sits the Deltar. It's just sitting there. My heart starts warping on me. Figured my milliseconds are numbered. This is a flash of light and just like that, a little planet toy explodes into a ball of fire. Why do I feel like I'm missing something? I should have more money than this. Did you not hack it right? Yeah, right. Again, there's the hacking thing. Missing here. Is that the droid I'm supposed to have? I don't know. What was getting me at the very end? Are the things killing you? This the acid stuff again. Oh come on! It's the foot. Yeah, <laughs> you're. It, you don't need a foot. Can't you? Can't you go on? Can't you hobble along just fine? I will be so glad when I don't have to do this stupid acid thing anymore. Now that I slightly understand it, it's a little bit easier. Are you sure about that? Yeah. 
see it. Walk right screen, go down. I don't think that's. See? 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 I understand it now. Are you so. Aren't you proud of yourself? Pretty sure there was supposed to be some money somewhere I could pick up. Used so much. The Blues Brothers, yes. Hey, I can try this again. I don't think so, Bucko. I'm not following you. Evil green alien. Trying to kill me. little robot question do I want to we're coming close to the end of the show do I want to keep going do you want to keep going 
No, I actually have to uh, get off. I, apparently, I have to open tomorrow. So. Wow. Okay. All right. Uh... Yeah. Six four two five. I'm pretty sure I'll remember that. Six four two five. All right. You know what? I think we will call it a night. How about you? Yeah. All right. So hey, everybody. I want to thank anybody out there that was possibly watching thank you for tuning in uh all kinds of shenanigans just took place <laughs> um our next show is tomorrow which is uh three vets and noob fantasy star online uh blue burst adventures two hours of insults comedy and camaraderie so uh please tune in as me rico matt and lance uh take on more challenges in fantasy star online mm -hmm. the summer event is over so who knows what we're gonna do find out tomorrow uh, Monday is a new GVN Live, 9 p.m. Eastern, uh, on, well, I said Monday, right? Yep. Yeah, Monday, and then next week will be the final Game Jam Original versus Remake. Next Wednesday, with Mark B. Writing as my guest, as we both play the original Tomb Raider and Tomb Raider Anniversary, which is the remake of the game that was done by Crystal Dynamics. So I want to thank everybody for tuning in, and you have yourselves a wonderful night. Peace. Thank you, John. Yeah, absolutely, Bob. I'll see you. Peace.